Hey YouTube, uh, Technometer with a quick fix video for you guys today. If your iPhone screen is not responding, you want to follow these quick tips to get you back working again. So let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is a force restart. So in order to do that, you're going to press and release the volume up and then press and release the volume down one after another quickly and then come over to the right hand side and hold on to this button until the screen goes completely black and you, once you see the Apple logo appear, you let go of that button. So let's show you how that's done volume up volume down quickly and then i hold on to that side button as you can see here you want to keep on holding that side button that's the key thing to this process you want to wait till the screen goes completely black and once you see the apple logo appear you'll let go of that side button so as you can see here i see the apple logo i let go of that side button this is known as a force restart basically shuts down the phone software and reloads the code which will fix any time a screen is not responding, glitching, or if the touch isn't responding to any part of your phone screen, it will fix it for you just like that. And it should be brand new again, working like it should. Now, let's say you did this, it doesn't work. You want to try it a few times to get it the hang of it. Sometimes you may not get it to work the right way. So just keep on doing that volume up, volume down one after another and hold on to that side button. Another thing to keep in mind is that if you recently install a temper glass, it could also interfere with the touch. So maybe you might consider removing it. And another thing is if your phone recently got wet or has liquid or any kind of debris or dust on it, take a microfiber cloth, lock your phone and just simply wipe it down to make sure there's no any liquid, any dust or any grime, anything that could potentially be causing that screen to not respond or just glitching. And after that, hopefully your iPhone is fixed and I hope this video was helpful. If so please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks like this one for your iPhone and other iOS devices. See you guys next time.